Yesterday, the California Highway Patrol announced the arrest of two suspects, one in connection with the killing of six-year-old Aiden Anthony Leos. There are few words to describe the feeling produced by the despicable actions of that day. The murder took place approximately two miles northeast of where we stand today on State Route 55. It goes without saying, no parent should be made to suffer the pain and loss Joanna, Joey, Alexis, and the rest of Aiden's extended family experienced that day. Both suspects, a male and female, are residents of Costa Mesa. We have recovered what we believe are the weapon and automobile used in the crime. But why, why so much interest in this little boy? And I think I, I know the answer. It's because it could have happened to any one of us. We all drive the freeways of Southern California. We've all gotten upset at other motorists. Other motorists have been upset at us. I've thrown some gestures about myself, but it's never come to a situation of violence and certainly not in my realm or your realm to the loss of a life. But I will say in general, that when you shoot at an occupied vehicle with a gun, that's an inherently dangerous act. And you know when you're going down a freeway or a toll road at 75 to 80 miles an hour, <clears throat> that when you put a, a bullet into somebody's car, that's an inherently dangerous act that could result in a person crashing or being hit by a bullet and the like. And it's not just philosophical or theoretical. It is practical because it actually happened.